Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer software testing interview question 54. That is, what is gray box testing? Let me answer. Gray box testing is a combination of black box testing and white box testing. As you can see in this diagram, gray box testing is nothing but black box testing plus white box testing, which becomes a gray box testing. But what exactly is this gray box testing? To understand what exactly is gray box testing, first we have to understand what is white box testing. Then we have to understand what is black box testing. Then you can understand what exactly is gray box testing. So let me first explain what is white box testing. In case of white box testing, a person who is performing this white box testing knows the internal code implementation in a full manner. Okay, the complete code that is used for developing the software will be known to the person who is performing the white box testing. That is white box testing. Right? Okay. What about black box testing? In black box testing, the person who is performing the black box testing doesn't know anything about the code that is used for developing the software. Instead, this particular person who is performing the black box testing will depend on the visual appearing functionalities of the software to perform testing. He doesn't know anything about the internal implementation of the code for developing the software. That is black box. Here, fully known in case of uh, white box, the internal implementation code is fully known in case of white box testing. Whereas, Completely unknown in case of black box testing. Okay, internal implementation code is completely unknown in case of black box, but in gray box it is partially known. Here fully known. Here is completely unknown. Here partially known, guys. You know it partially. Okay, the code that has been used for developing the software is partially known. It's not completely known or entirely known, but it's partially known. Okay, the pun who is performing the gray box testing will have some knowledge. Okay, has some high level knowledge of what code has been written for developing the software but he doesn't he or she doesn't have the entire knowledge but a partial knowledge is there so what is the advantage guys okay just to conclude guys in gray box testing method the internal code structure of the application is partially known to the tester who is performing the gray box testing okay it's here it is partially known so what is the advantage okay what is the advantage uh, advantage of the gray box testing over the black box testing in case of black box testing right we only test the software by depending on the visual appearing functionalities of the software, right? So the one who is performing black box testing will uh, will create some test cases in advance, right? He will not directly perform the testing, right? He, he or she has to create some test cases to perform the black box testing. But in case of gray box testing, the person who is performing the gray box testing has partial knowledge of the internal code implementation of the software. With, the, with that partial knowledge, this particular person will create even more better test cases than the black box. Okay, the one who is performing black box testing will create some test cases guys, but the one who knows gray box testing that is partial implementation of uh, partially the person knows the internal code implementation that particular person can create even more better test cases because internal logic implementation is also known in this case of the gray box testing in gray box testing as the tester has partial knowledge of the internal coding structure he or she will design the better test cases okay for testing the visual appearing functionalities of the software so here uh, what we are going to do with the help of this is uh, if you are doing the gray box testing guys with the knowledge of the partial with the partial knowledge of the internal code implementation of the software we will be able to create the better test cases for testing the software okay in a black box only we'll test okay here with the knowledge that is coming by the partial implementation of the code in the white box we are implementing in that black box okay we are utilizing that particular knowledge for creating better test cases for testing the visual appearing functionalities of the software okay with this partial knowledge of the code implementation we are testing the visual appearing functionalities of the software in a better way by creating more better test cases okay so here both are taking advantage of each other right white box test uh, partial knowledge of the code implementation is taking advantage of the black box testing. Okay, that becomes a gray box testing. Okay, so hope guys you got the answer for what is gray box testing and how it is useful and all. So that's all for this session. The next session, I'm going to answer another software testing interview question for you. Till then, see you. Bye bye.